Good morning and welcome back to Aussie Food Journeys. Today we've got the boat hooked on, so we're um, going, heading off to Port Wakefield, which is 27 kilometres from uh, Balaclava where we're staying. And we're going to hopefully, we'll hopefully catch a fish, but um, at least get some sand crabs because we um, called into the tackle shop there at Port Wakefield last week and he gave us a few pointers and um, you know, directional space places on where to fish because there's a few no fishing zones around there so he you know told us sort of which direction to head in to get oh for the best chance for getting fish so we'll see how we go today um, high tide's about two hours away so we're hoping to fish the um, you know the turn of the tide basically and just have a few hours out there to see what we can catch so yeah we'll meet you at the boat ramp Right, we're trying our hand today at fishing at Port Wakefield. Oh, that was a bit bright. We're very tidal dependent on this boat ramp because the water goes way, way out. So we've only got a couple of hours fishing here during high tide. So we'll see how we go. So the boat normally, um, when we're driving around with the caravan, obviously goes on the roof of our Prado. Um, we've just got a little foldable aluminium trailer that stacks neatly on the back of the caravan. And uh, we don't like to tow it long distances, but Robert was happy with the 27 k's. And um, it towed really well. And yeah, this is the first time having a go here at Port Wakefield. So we'll see how we go. We haven't used the boat very much because we've been working pretty much the whole time we've been in South Australia. So we'll see how we go. Fish here. <laughs> and I've got a uh, baby snapper. Yeah, he's a bit small. You're not allowed to keep snapper actually here until 2026, 20, I don't think. Yeah, there's a total Closed. man on him over here yeah. at the moment. So, but he's so anyway, cute. something to do. Beautiful little crab. He's cute, he's cute. Oh, I do. Oh, I'm gonna get this off the hook. Oh, hey, look. Two oh. fish, one bait. You have to keep your bait even. I know. Dad's videoing the bait bucket. <laughs> Alright, he's checking the crab pot. Sit in the rod hole, please. Turn it upside down. Right, yeah. Right. Signing. So just pull fast? Yep. Oh, 
little crabs. <laughs> oh, there's a couple of little ones, which is good, good signs, sign. I suppose. I love them when they've got one claw. Female to male. Did I tip them out? Yeah, just tip them out. Tip them out and then throw it back. They're too small. That's all right. Why are you getting promising. little ones? You can get big ones. We'll keep trying. You probably got weed too. Uh, My fish is camouflaged. I actually thought I had a fish and then I thought I was snagged. Yeah, <laughs> what is he again? Oh, Trumpeters. There you go. Oh, you're right. Sorry, I moved. Yeah. <laughs> Only a little boat in there. Another little one. This Anyways, tell him to bring all his friends. Bigger yeah, ones. Okay. Oh, it's not a little one. Bites. Oh, oh, oh no, he got off. <laughs> Did he? Yeah. See, you're useless. Oh, there you go. They got me bait. All squid. All squid. You got no bait, bro. Like it's probably bite to start with. No. Oh yeah, you got little bites. Only not a little fella. Oh. Uh, not a little squire. A, oh, another little squire. Well, at least there's something. It's supposed to get bigger, not smaller, but anyway. <laughs> Checking the crab pots. Checking the crab pots. Are they any bigger? Nothing. There's nothing. Well, that's rude. Been left. No. What? Yeah, like, frisbee. Alright, you catch each one from me. Mm. Mm. That one got bigger. Yeah, that's still not big enough. Big enough. Are they? Are you sure? Yeah, they're definitely not too big enough. What did you get, Nisha? Oh, little stripy thing. Oh. <laughs> oh well. We say oh well, but it was a fish. Something to do. Thank you. 
Stravi. Oh, what do you mean? That's not reaching. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you did drive what time you did. <laughs> Go! <laughs> <laughs> I get the smaller. Oh no. Getting smaller though. Please. I have faith, Tanisha, so yours will be bigger. I'll catch the monster. He was gonna escape. He's pretty small. Well, he could have yeah. escaped. He's, he's pretty small. He's gonna fall through right, the hole. I reckon, I reckon we go somewhere else. Okay. All right. Yeah, you can get it off. Slimy little bugger. Well. Now, we can honestly say there's not a lot of fish just here. A lot of little things that we can't eat. But, again, we don't have a fish finder and we have no idea where we're going. We're just going off what the local tackle shop sort of told us in the direction of where to go. And, you know, whatever. It's passing a few hours and it's nice out here in the water anyway. What now? Ah. Let's see if there's a crab. No crabs. I think I'm to go back into where that weed and that is. I did not throw a crab at you. I can't even see where my thing is. Oh, there he is. I got a crab. He's hanging on for dear life. <laughs> there he is. Smashed in the middle. Oh. They eat through their bum. <laughs> <laughs> That's what they call a shit fish. That just looks fucking staged. <laughs> you hooked it sideways. Just good job. Badly. Stayed he probably was eating this bait off this hook and then went to that one as you just <laughs> That's my verdict anyway. Yeah, probably a good possibility. Tanisha, step out. Watch your fingers. Watch your fingers. <laughs> right. So, hold that. I'll just go. Hang on. Yeah. I might even do a voiceover if you can't hear it anyway. Well, we didn't catch anything, so we're back at the boat <laughs> ramp. 
but it was a nice morning out on the water. It was water. good morning. It actually flattened out quite nice. The yeah, I've seen a couple of dolphins up. and yeah. I caught a couple of little fish, but plenty of crabs, but all undersized. But hey, anyway. that's all part of it. So we're going home for lamb chops for dinner tonight, I guess, instead of fish and crabs. Oh well, it's all so good. <laughs> all good. Water. Yeah, Tanisha stuck her foot in there just then. Oh, neat. Yeah. She said she'd love to go for a dip before I head. <laughs> well, thanks for watching and we'll uh, see you next episode. <laughs>